beautiful people welcome or welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is Nadia and welcome to this week's layering videos it is Friday so happy Friday you guys will see this Saturday so I want to go ahead and tell y'all happy new year because I might I have a video I actually need to put up for Sunday but we'll see if I have time to edit it over the weekend but if I don't I want to go ahead and tell you guys happy new year 2024 is here it came so fast it is crazy how fast 2023 went by um but yeah we're just gonna jump right into the video i have such an awesome week for you guys i smell uh, so good i've been just kind of pulling my own combinations i noticed the last couple of weeks we're gonna get back into using you guys combos next week so the first combination i have i don't have an outfit because I worked Saturday, which was the Saturday before Christmas. Um, that was my Saturday to work. So I didn't take a picture of my outfit, but I did have a combo. It wasn't a big one. I just repeated one of the combos that I had because it smelled so good when I wore it the last time. And that is the Way St. Bart's Body Cream. And I mixed it with Unleashed A-Trap Revs. Y'all, I am going through this bottle. I'm going through this bottle. And I'm going to be sick when it's... Even though this wasn't expensive, I want to say it was like $40.00. If that, maybe not even that. For this size bottle, I can't be sniffing these scents right like I normally do. My head is killing me right now. And I'm still doing this video because I have, when I commit to something, I have to see it all the way through. But my head hurts. You know how your head hurts so bad sometimes that it makes you nauseous? That's me right now. And it's because I had something. It was so funny. My coworkers, we were talking about it and we were like, well, did you eat something? Did you? And I was like, well, I had that fried rice, the vegetable fried rice. And I put, I was like, and I had soy sauce. My coworker was like, you put more soy sauce on it. That's why your blood pressure is probably up. And I was like, huh? Because I'm this, that's the only thing I could think of or whatever, because my head just started hurting out of the blue, but I took something to make it go away. So we gonna still roll on, okay? So the next combo. So Sunday's combination was actually Went in again with Way St. Bart's Body Cream. And then I went in with Bond Number no. 9's Nolita. So y'all know we had the 20% coupon and then I had a gift card from Ulta. So I went ahead and purchased. I was in there and I was like, what am I going to get? I have mostly everything in here that I want. Until I really thought about it and I was like, oh, you don't have the regular Jimmy Choo. Because I skipped over this one because I had COVID nose. And when I smelled it, I was like, that does not smell good. Like when it came out and I smelled it, I, I didn't like it. So I skipped it and got Jimmy Choo, I want you forever. And y'all know how I feel about that. Well, now I, after I my COVID nose went away, it's like, okay, Nadia, you really missed the mark on that one. Because that one smells good. Also, just like the Jimmy Choo, I want you forever. Like I said, I had COVID nose, so it did not smell good to me when I first smelled it. So I mixed No Letha with this Jimmy Choo. Y'all, when I tell y'all this smelled so freaking good. Oh my God, it smelled. When I, y'all already know Nolita. If y'all smell Nolita, and of course, if y'all know Jimmy Choo, I want you. Y'all know this was an extremely feminine scent. It smelled really, 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 really good. Okay. Christmas Day, you guys, I did not. was Well, that was Monday, so I don't have a combo for Monday because I was cooking, finishing cooking that morning. And by the time I showered and all that, I just kind of laid around in my Christmas stuff. We didn't go anywhere for Christmas. We stayed here or whatever because I cooked at home and I had family come here, but I didn't leave out of the house for Christmas, so I did not have a combo for Monday. But Tuesday, I had a combo. Because I went back to work Tuesday because y'all know I was on vacation last week. But this was my outfit for Tuesday. Just this pantsuit that I have. This pantsuit is so simple, but I just thought I was so cute when I wore this. This pantsuit came from Shein. I like Shein's clothes, but what I have noticed, like on the blazers that I have from them, out of all the blazers that I have, a lot of the blazers are beaded. You know how when you wash stuff and it gets the beads on the material? The back of them. is So one of them, the front, like right here on the blazer is like that. But all the other ones, it's like that in the back. And it's like, why? I don't know why they're, they beaded like that. But it makes me not want to order blazers from them anymore. 
this suit jacket has it just a little bit and you really can't notice it but i notice it because of course i'm looking for it now that i notice my other separate blazers have that on there but anyway suit from uh shein shirt from walmart shoes are from dillard's those are jessica simpson combination started with tree huts 24 hour shea butter in moroccan rose i'm staring at that like i don't know what it is um, <laughs> and it's so crazy i had this for a while you guys and i realized i've only used it like three times so this thing is almost it's still full and i have had this for a while i don't know why i wasn't using this so crazy this this scrub smells exactly like the body butter does like when i say exactly like it then i went in with mancera roses greedy the name explains it all but y'all know how mancera fragrances has that like specific dna that you can tell that it's a mancera fragrance that's how roses greedy is but it is definitely a rosy a very very feminine rosy fragrance i love it it smells really really good and then i went and topped it off with glossier u again this one is so this is like a girl's girl's fragrance to me. To me, this is kind of young smelling. And like I told y'all before, I held on to it for months because it's kind of screechy. It's still screechy to me, but it smells good. And it smelled so good when I paired these two together. Again, this is Mancera Roses Greedy and Glossier U. It was still screechy. <laughs> I don't think it's just, to me, it's just something about it that smells extremely screechy. And I don't think I'll ever get past it smelling like that but I'm not gonna lie spraying these two together they smelled really really good it was like a very girly feminine rosy um, type combination it smelled good especially like a lot of you guys like the glossy AU if you like that and you got roses greedy try those together it smelled good it's just the roses greedy gives me screechy I'm, I'm sorry the, uh, the glossy AU gives me screechy and I don't think I'll ever be able to get past it but it's still it still smells good, but it's, it's scratchy. So moving on to Wednesday. This was my Wednesday's outfit. Y'all have seen these pants before. I got these pants from Fashion Nova. Actually, the shirt came from Fashion Nova also. The sucky thing about me telling y'all where I got my stuff from, most of the time, like these pants, I had them last year. I bought them last year. So did I the blue suit that I just had on. Most of the time, the clothes that I wear, I have had them for a while. So when I tell you guys about them, then it's like me telling you where I get them from. If you go look for them, most of the time they won't even have them anymore because I've probably had them for a while. That's the only sucky thing about me telling y'all that. Because y'all did say that y'all want me to, you know, tell you where I got this stuff from. Um, I don't know if I said also, but the shirt also came from Fashion Nova. And then the heels, y'all can't see them anyways, but I got those from Marshalls. But yeah, so that was my Wednesday's outfit. Wednesday's combination started off with Carol's Daughter Almond Frappe Body Lotion. And then I remember, I have so many comments I have to go reply to you guys. I'm sorry, but I have been all over the place the last well, month, really. Y'all know, I told y'all about everything that's been going on here. You know, we're trying to catch up and be there for people and all that stuff. This one perfume that I'm about to show y'all, I talked about it on one video and told y'all that it was a dupe for the Givenchy Linter D, however you say it. <laughs> and you asked me, I haven't had a chance to respond, but you asked me to tell you what the perfume was because you did, and I said I was gonna wait and do like a comparison video on the two. And you was like, I don't wanna wait. You know, can you tell me what the perfume is? And I saw the comment, but I just have not had a chance to respond. But this is the perfume. So screenshot this. Y'all see how big this bottle is. This is, I bought this off of Amazon. So it's AL space IBDAA. Yeah, I'm almost positive I got this off of Amazon. I'm gonna go and add it to my storefront so that you guys can get to it also. But this is a 3.4 ounce bottle and it was fairly cheap. Strong, you guys. When I say strong, now what I did notice is I didn't spray this heavy because I, when you smell it, it smells like I should not be sniffing this like this with me having such a bad headache, but it comes off so strong. 
even though the Givenchy version of it does also but it's like I know how much of that I can spray this I really wasn't sure how much I could spray because I really hadn't worn it like out out or whatever so I sprayed it but not as much as I normally spray my other fragrances because it's strong I did notice that the Givenchy version lasted longer it's probably because I spray more of that but I didn't this because I was kind of scared. I was going to work and I was like, no, well, not. you need to be careful because that perfume is strong. But now I know that I can go heavier the next time that I wear it. So I mix it. And then especially because of the combination that I did, I knew I couldn't do too, too much. So I went in with that and then I topped it with this Versace Nior. Y'all, my bottle is about to be done for. And I told y'all, I said I wasn't going to rebuy this. This was on my not to rebuy list. And I told y'all that I, I'm going to take that back. I am going to eventually rebuy this. I'm working on rebuying the perfumes that I've, I'm emptying out. I'm going one by one or <laughs> whatever. But y'all, this smells so good. And this is the perfect weather for a combination that is this heavy. This is a heavy combination. If y'all know how this smells and know how that Givenchy Linter D smells, y'all know how strong this combination is. Smelled so good together like grown when I say grown and I don't mean like old lady grown I mean like grown you got your stuff together you dress real nice you look real good today grown I loved it okay we're at Thursday and I just realized I was saying the wrong days see this is why I tell y'all I need to start taking pictures every day so I can attack so I can not stop skipping days All right, so next is yesterday, which was Thursday, my 41st birthday. So next is this outfit. Yeah, again, I bought this outfit. I know I've had this, this suit a year. Now the shirt that I have on has like a little scrunchy neck that came from Target. They have that right now. <laughs> and it's long sleeve, but the suit, I bought this suit last year. It's been hanging in my closet. I've never worn it and I was like so yesterday was my birthday Thursday December 28th was so my birthday yesterday but I was like I want to be cute on my birthday what am I gonna wear I want to wear something I haven't worn that's cute that's still work appropriate and I was like oh wait I got that suit that's just sitting in the closet been sitting in there all this time so pull it out I love suits I'm a suit girl if I could pick a nice suit every day of the week I would tweak it a few different ways I'm a suit girl. So I wore that with the same Jessica Simpson leopard shoes. And then, like I said, the shirt came from Target. The shoes are actually at Dealers right now, if y'all thought those were cute. Suit came from Fashion Nova. Possibly they'll have it on there. I'm not sure, but I did get it, I think, like, like I said, last year. But yeah, so this was my birthday outfit, you guys. Y'all ready to see my birthday combination? Because you know I slept good on my birthday. Y'all, I'm 41. Can y'all believe that? Like, my 30s just, I blinked and they were gone kind of crazy it's like i got a 19 year old about to be 20 it's insane but anyways this is what i wore yesterday on my birthday happy birthday to me i had a really really great birthday I ended up crying because i was like the people around me like me for one people can love you all day long but uh, yeah a lot of times they don't like you okay <laughs> People can love you, people can care for you, people can all of that. But to me, it matters that the people, of course, love you. People will automatically love you if you, especially if you're family, they will automatically love you. Coworkers might be like, oh, I love her, that's my coworker, you know. But to know that people actually like you, like how you are, like who you are as a person, that is big for me because people love out of habit a lot of times. Um, that's the way I feel. They, they do. People love because they feel like they're supposed to, uh, and things like that. But people don't always have to like you. And that's, so when people, like, my coworkers was like, you know, when I, I actually teared up, I started kind of like softly crying or whatever. And I was like, y'all really, like, for one, we, when we talk, y'all listen to the point that I'm a gift giver and I'm the type of gift giver that when people are talking to me your birthday could be in november and if you and i are talking about something in february i'm gonna make a mental note of that while we're talking and then when you step away from me i'm gonna probably put that note in my phone so that hey keisha likes such and such and such so that when your birthday rolls around in november i don't have to guess what i want to get you for your birthday 
I'm going to know because I have a mental note and I probably put the note in my phone. Especially if you're somebody that I know I'm going to be around. I'm going to remember those things. I'm going to make notes in my phone. I'm probably going to go ahead and get it <laughs> so that I don't forget what, what it was. Like that's the type of gift giver I am. When I hear people talk, I'm going to listen to hear what they talk about so that when Christmas rolls around, birthday rolls around or whatever it is, when I have to buy them something, whatever the occasion is, I already know what to get because I've been listening to you talk about this thing or that thing or this thing, these things that you like, you know, throughout our conversations. And it's like, that's what my coworkers did yesterday um, to me. Like stuff that I have mentioned and talked about over the months and times and just them knowing me and knowing the things I like, that's how they gifted me yesterday. So it brought tears to my eyes. I actually cried a little bit. And I'm a G. <laughs> Let me stop. I'm not. <laughs> but yeah, it was like really, really sweet. So I think I'm getting emotional in like 41 years of age. Is that right? I don't know. Anyways, that was my outfit, y'all. Okay. Whew. My medicine is actually kicking in. Thank God. Because my head was hurting so bad. It was to the point I felt like I was going to vomit. But yeah. So like I said, that was my... 41 and classy birthday outfit because I'm gonna I'm gonna be classy. I'm not gonna be walking around here and nigga. I don't care how I am built and shaped. I am gonna I love classy clothes. Like and that don't mean I'm gonna be walking around here looking like a nun. It just means that I've always I feel like been I don't know if I've been a modest person. I don't know. But I love classy feminine people will look at you like she might have a little money. Look how she dressed. Or where has she been today? Oh, you look really nice. I was in Dillard's. Look at me sidetracking. Anyways, y'all know how I do. I was in Dillard's before Christmas going in there looking for a cake pan. And this old lady walked by me. Well, that lady wasn't old. That lady probably was... She wasn't old. She was in her 70s. She had white hair, but she wasn't old. And to me, 70s is not old because my aunts are 70s. And they, they are not old. So, yeah, she wasn't old. I said old, but she really wasn't. She was just like a little lady or whatever. But she had white hair and she walked by me. And you know how they kind of get close to you? She got close to me and she put, like, put her finger on my shoulder right there. She was like, you look so good. I love the outfit you have on. So well put together, professional. She was like, you look beautiful. I love your outfit. And I was like, thank you. And she's a little like, thank you so much. I get kind of shy. But, yeah, so I was like... That's like the impact that I want to give people when they see me on a regular day. Because it's a Saturday looking at me like, because I had on slacks and a shirt and then a vest that matched my um, slacks or whatever. But it was like, you know what? I feel good in this outfit. I know I'm cute. I had on my heels. Like I told y'all, I wear heels literally almost every day now. If I have on clothes, I probably have on heels. And I love it. Anyways, my birthday... <laughs> I'm oh, sorry, y'all, but I missed y'all. I feel I actually I haven't recorded all week since my last video, so I miss y'all. But anyway, love y'all a long time. Sorry, <laughs> my birthday combination started with the Lena body cream. So y'all know it's about to be a heavy hitter. Y'all know the Lena body cream, and then I feel like y'all my friends. Like I like talking to y'all. These are FaceTime chats that we do they just we're just talking about perfume you know how all the people over the world are into perfume right now and i love it this is us talking about our perfume y'all just listening to me all right then i went in with club denuit imperial get it i don't know how many times i have to tell y'all to get this and men if you're watching this too get this for your woman because y'all be watching i see it get it you're not gonna go wrong with this i promise so Imperial, and I topped it with Nishan A, 100 Silent Waves. <laughs> Y'all. <laughs> Me and my friend went to eat for my uh, birthday last night. Took my coat off. I had on off-white. So, and I'm like, I don't want nothing to splash on my outfit. So, I took the, the napkin in the front of my pants and sprayed it on my legs. And I took my coat off because the shirt is like, fine. If some splashes on that, it is what it is. I'll just wash it. But my white suit? No. I grabbed my suit off of the chair next to me. I mean, my jacket off the chair next to me to put it back on. She said, I, I can smell the jacket when you move it. It's just like we putting it back on, y'all. This combination, screenshot this. This combination smelled so 
good, you guys. When I say, oh my God, so good. <sighs> it smells good. Oh, so classy, beautiful. Like, it's, if you know what Delina Exclusive smells like, that's what Imperial, sm Imperial smells like. But it smells better. Dare me that it don't. <laughs> I'm just joking. But y'all, it smells so good again. Most of us know, us perfume girls, we know what Delina, Delina Exclusive smells like at this point. We know, one or the other. Imperial. Chef's kiss. I'm trying to tell y'all. I looked good, smelled good, felt good on my birthday. It was really a great day. I'm 41, you guys. 41. All right. So, oh, I had on this brooch too. Let me show y'all my brooch. Ain't that cute? So that's what it looked like at the top. And then that's y'all can see the neck of the shirt, how it was made. It was super cute. This is today's outfit. Today is Friday, the 29th. This is the outfit that I have on right now. It was cold today. This belt is so unique because this belt does not, it looks like it ties in the front, but it does not. It snaps in the back. Like it has two snap buttons and they snap. So the back of the belt is smooth across the back. When I bought this belt, I was like, I'm going to need this eventually. I need to get this because it don't have a tie. It don't have a buckle in the back. It snaps closed so that'll keep the back smooth like it was made like this. Like made to go with something. And it's not. I bought this belt and this blazer years apart. Shirt. I do not remember where I got this blazer from you guys. The shirt I think came from Walmart. The pants came from like Marshalls. Y'all know Marshalls be having all them kind of cheap slacks and black leg like um, skinny legs. That's where I get most of them from. Leg warmers, don't know. Boots, fashion over. This jacket probably came from Marshalls also to be. I love Marshalls. If y'all don't have Marshalls near y'all, y'all need to go find a Marshalls. But yeah. But yeah, so I love that this outfit. It's super cute. It's professional. It, like, I could wear this to work. If my friends and I were going out to eat, I would wear this out to eat. And it's because of how it's styled. With the belt on top of the blazer like that. Then these these boots that I got um and I wore these instead of my shark boots because they have the brown um color on the bottom that matches the brown in my jacket so yeah um but today's combination was jasmine peach from EOS and then we went in with these two perfumes that I paired together today literally both of them are about to be empty and it's like why did you grab two of the bottles that you know are about to be empty very soon and put them in a combination together why did you do that but it, when they get low like this it start, starts to annoy me that they're almost empty so i'll make it my business to empty them out i don't know why and then i'll just put them back on my list my list to replace them so somebody can buy these for my birthday but my family didn't well my boyfriend bought me perfume but, but i'm like Y'all ain't buy me no perfume. I know people are probably scared to buy me perfume because for boy, y'all know, do y'all ever have people that say you got enough perfume and then they don't want to buy you perfume because you got a lot of perfume? It's like, are you mad? Why would you think I wouldn't want more perfume just because I have a lot? I can never have too many. Buy me perfume. Even if you're scared, get me a gift card. I will go buy my own. I promise. <laughs> but yeah, so this combination was Donna Born and Roma, Prada Candy. Look at my Prada Candy, y'all. Look at that. That's all I got left. That's it. Born and Roma, she, I had, last time I put this in a video, I, it was up here, like two levels of the stones. This time we're down to one. Cause she's about to be empty. These have got to be replaced ASAP. Because I love I know I don't put Prada Candy in video a lot, and it's because I know she's almost empty. I have this small bottle in this. I want this in the biggest bottle because I love this that much. When this first came out, I've been buying this since it came out. And I don't think I'll never not buy it. I just think it's beautiful. And then I mixed it with Born Aroma. I mean, I think all of us have these at this point. <laughs> Aren't they amazing? Like, they are, they're good. Y'all, they about to be empty. I'm gonna cry again. <laughs> I love them though, for real. But you guys, that is, uh, that's the end of the video. 
I know I talked a lot, but I really, really missed y'all. I'm just going to have to, I keep saying this, I'm going to have to start vlogging more so that I can do a lot of talking. But I don't like talking about fragrances in my vlogs because it's my vlog. And I talk about fragrances on these videos. Then I have fragrances that have their own dedicated video. And it's like, I leave that content for its own video. So me talking about it in, y'all just just in there. I, it, it, it is what it is <laughs> but y'all will start watching my vlogs eventually now like i said y'all are seeing this on saturday so my best friend and i went to eat last night for my actual birthday so that you know because she's like you need to actually go eat do something on your birthday because i did her the same way for her birthday pretty much but tonight well tomorrow night which will be saturday night y'all are seeing this saturday i am having a perfume exchange dinner and everybody's required to dress up like not casual i told them to dress up so most of us are probably going to be in dresses but yeah we're doing a perfume exchange dinner so everybody at my birthday dinner will get a gift <laughs> because we're all exchanging i bought two perfumes so my person will get two so whoever that is lucky you girl lucky you but we're just gonna pull names and make it easy make it make sure it's fair and yeah, I'm so excited. Y'all will see my dress, but y'all won't see my dress until maybe. Maybe I'll do the dinner video. It depends on how I do the, the, the dinner video. And then y'all will see my dress. It's cute. I think it's different. Um, the colors, it don't matter. Y'all will see it when it comes up. Anyways, if you made it this far, tell me happy birthday. <laughs> <laughs> because I made a post yesterday wishing myself happy birthday. Uh, um, some of y'all saw it, but if you made it this far, tell me happy birthday. I would really, really appreciate it. We have to be faithful, you guys, because at first I was like, I am 41 years old. But then I'm like, you're 41 years old. It's a blessing. So many people didn't make it to 41. So many people didn't make it to 40. It's a blessing. I am thankful. I am forever grateful to be on this earth another day, month, second, week. I am forever grateful. I'm grateful for you guys. I love y'all. Thank y'all so much for tuning in. Before you leave, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you in my next video, girl. Have a great weekend and Happy New Year.